What to do this cash out, Mr. Cash Not himself. I got all the latest twerking, you dig? And you're logged on to KYS, you dig DC? Yeah. Uh, I think it's not a lot of conscious songs out right now as far as radio and, you know, going hard on radio because it's just a different time and era right now. You know, it's um, the generation's different, the young people. It's, it's really kids and, you know, females and, and things like that. So once they tune in or lock into the radio, you, you, you will have those type of records, you know, at a certain time of the day, you feel me? But, you know, this generation now is about club bangers like who gonna have the next hottest club banger? And you know the clubs won't, won't be live without club bangers. You can't just go to no club and they just playing conscious music all night. Like it, it's no point of going to the club to have fun. Everybody gonna be sad and thinking about what they did and all that now. So that's that's how I, I, I separate. You know, um, you know, it, I call it like ride music. You know, like you got great. Even with Kendrick Lamar, he's a great artist. He, he, he got great album cuts, but he always knew he had to have that, that one or two radio smash, too, with Drank or the song with um, Drake, you feel me, the female records. So you got to have those type of records, too, the club bangers, the, the female records that pe the females can still bounce to at the same time. And, you know, you can have the, the great album music, the riding music, the conscious music. So when you get in your car and you just leave, you tired of the club or you just want to ride and do your thing, that's, that's what a conscious music and the great album cuts come in at right there. I think Boosie remind me of him, you know, um, for real, because I've been riding a Boosie and a lot of his music relates to things you things you um, go through in life and things you done been through in life, especially as a street person. So, and, and you think about it, even with the music that Boosie makes, you know, like the the conscious music, he still got that 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 radio hit, that um, wipe me down, or that that independent chick for the females with him and Webby, or that show the world. It's still you still got some type of song where when you drop it in front of a hundred thousand people, you can hit them checking your record. We gonna show the world, or she twerking. You feel me? Like you can just hear thousands of people saying that when you drop the beat. So. You know, you still got to have that in your deck as an artist, no matter how lyrical you are, you feel me? Because there's a lot of great rappers out there, but can't find a hit to get them to the next level. So you always got to have that hit, even even if you're a great lyrical rapper. Uh, figure out your process. Like when I'm when I'm in the studio, um, it starts from the beat regardless, you feel me? If I ain't got no hot track, I can't think of no hot hook or something to come up with, you feel me? So it definitely started with the beat. Normally when I go in with producers, we cook from scratch. I don't want to hear a thousand beats you done played for a thousand other artists, you feel me? I want you to cook some. You know, I make beats too, so I want you to come in with me. We cook some up, and once we cook that, you can know this one or two tracks me and Cash out there, and I, I played 50 beats for Drake, 50 beats for Future, 50 beats for K-Camp. Now, this is beat me and Cash Out did, the Cash Out name on it. And, it's, and, and you come up with hits like that, too. Just think about She Twerking was made like that. Hold Up Future when Wale was made like that. Cash and I was made like that, all from scratch, you feel me? So when you get in with them producers, you, you get them your thoughts, and he give you your thoughts, or he or she, and y'all put them thoughts together and, and make a beautiful, beautiful hit.